Hi ladies, I'm Lynn Poland, founder of Kindred Beginnings, a family building support community. A patient advocate and fertility coach, I have made it my personal mission to provide the education, resources, and supports you need as you navigate your own family building journey. Today, I wanna to talk to you about toxins. On average, there are about 62 toxic chemicals in your home and you can be exposed to upwards of 700,000 various toxic chemicals a day. Crazy, right? Exposure to a consumption of toxins disrupts your hormones and obviously affects your overall health. And we know that fertility is an extension of our health, right? So let's talk about how to start making some small shifts to help reduce your toxic exposure. So first of all, we really need to be mindful of common products and areas in our home that harbor toxins, such as cleaners, clothing, mattresses, carpets, cosmetic and beauty products, shampoos, hairspray, deodorants, toothpastes, plastics, and foods. A really manageable way to start making the swap to cleaner products would be to buy better next time. So do you need more food containers? Buy glass ones. Did you run out of deodorant? Switch to a non-toxic organic one next time. As you need to buy again, make better, smarter, non-toxic choices. One really important area that you need to address in your home is your water. It is essential that you have a good water filtration system and not just for drinking, but think about using water for bathing, cleaning, and laundering too. Water can contain hundreds of chemicals and pollutants that directly impact you and your family's health. And if you think that drinking bottled water that has been sitting in plastic and exposed to various temperatures before making its way into your hands is good enough, think again, it's not. The Environmental Working Group is one of the best organizations for identifying toxin and toxin-free products. So I would encourage you to visit that site to learn, to learn more, Environmental Working Group. I challenge you to reduce one toxin in your home next month and then keep going. Your fertility, your health, and your family, and you are worth it. Small changes can yield to big results.